I used to drive in my uh, home country, but when I was arrived here at the beginning, I was very frightened and scared from the idea of driving here. I found it at the end, it's very easy. Just hit the road, follow the rules and that's all. My name is Dunya Rahimi. I'm from Iraq. I came to Australia with my family, my two kids and my husband, uh, to do my master degree in education at the University of New England, Armidale, New South Wales. I'm highly influenced on my mom's perspective about education. Even though she was a literate woman, she could not read or write properly, she was always focusing on the importance of education for all of us, especially for me and my sisters, because uh, she believed that education is like a powerful weapon that every woman needs. She thought that education is just like a passport uh, to a good job opportunity that can guarantee good living standard for any woman and her family. She kept pushing me towards uh, completing my, my education, but unfortunately, in my, on my fourth stage in, uh, in my university study, she died because of her heart, heart attack. She asked my dad always for pushing me to complete my uh, higher education degree. She was a very strong woman. She was always caring about helping others. She was always caring about the community. I think I inherited that sense of, of caring for community from, from her. Well, Dunya was a student at the university, but she was also very aware of the needs of the other Iraqi wives who were not students, who didn't have access to the community. What can you see in this picture? And they are just sitting at home, nothing to do, raising the kids. They still have limited English and they are shy to communicate with, with neighbors because they don't have that connection to practice the language. And so she has been looking for a number of ways to bring them out and meet other people in the Armadale community where possible, or at least uh, provide a, a, a play space for the children and a space where the ladies could get together and talk. We are coming from uh, a country that always suffer with war. Uh, there is always pain, there is always a hard situation. Uh, so that's why we, we, we used to help each other. We used to support each other just in order to survive, in order to live. Whenever there will be a, a doctor appointment, I try to help interpreting or translating from English to Arabic and from Arabic to English. I just concerned about the due date for the pregnancy. The visiting doctor is one of the important things that those ladies need and the health information is really important. And the blood pressure is 63 which is quite low too. I feel very happy whenever I, I felt that I did something and make some difference for anyone or make some difference for my community or any other community. Armidale is quiet, small, green city. Uh, when we firstly arrived here, we started to look uh, or surfing the net about uh, possible places to visit, uh, to have fun or to spend a holiday. There are a lots of national parks and also waterfalls. And one of those places is uh, Ipo Waterfall. It's really nice and a uh, wonderful place. The most important factor that we found here is safety. This factor is really important for living as a family. Here, you're allowed to be open, you're allowed to be independent. So that's what I like about this community and this, this culture. <laughs> 